Hi guys, and the objective of this video is to go through a question related to the first law of thermodynamics. So here is our question. A piston cylinder device initially contains steam at 300 kilopascals and 240 degrees Celsius with a volume of 0.45 meters cubed. At this point, a linear spring is touching the piston but exerts no force on it. Heat is then slowly transferred to the system system causing the pressure and the volume to rise to 400 kilopascals and 0.5 meters respectively. So the question is asking us to find the final temperature, the work done by the steam and the heat transferred in this process. So let us look diagrammatically of what exactly is happening in this system. We have over here a piston cylinder arrangement except now this is not the one that we usually used to. There is a spring involved over here. A control volume is still this section right here, and it is still a closed system. However, there is a new force at play, that is namely the spring force. Now, if you recall from Hooke's law, our spring force is uh, uh, also because the question also says